Bella's come into our kindy program and she uses um, Auslan for her communication. So she's using sign to talk to us. That's not your sign name. You did miss it. You said my name is Mrs Nickel. <laughs> so it means in kindy that we've been doing a lot more signing. We've already always done some signing, but we're signing all the time now and the children are learning the signs alongside Bella and um, learning to communicate her with her and talk to her. My sign name is Tegan. It, it means that Bella can be part of our kindy program totally. She can have friends, she can go home and talk about her friends, she can join in with the play, she can get her message across to the children. And it's really made the other children um, understand that people have differences and different ways of talking, different ways of communicating. And they really like to play with her and have fun with her and they all sign. She's really part of our kindy class. Why? When people are using sign, Auslan sign, you have to have a name so that you're not spelling out your name. And every time you meet a person, you get given um, a special sign that means you. So Bella had to give us that sign. So the children chose, the children and their families chose something that meant them. My sign name is Gemma. So they all chose a name and then Bella gave it the yes, the yes or the no. My fine name is Emmy. So it means when Bella goes home in the afternoon she can talk about her friends. She can say, Gemma played with me today or you know, Sophie, Sophie was my friend or she can, she can talk about her friends. My sign name is Mrs Nicholl. That means gardening, because I, I like gardening. Sometimes children can't always explain what they want to in their words, but you know, like if, they, if they're feeling sad, sometimes they'll just come up and do sad. So instead of using their words, they, it's just another means for them to communicate. I think it's really making us realise that there are differences and that we can include everybody as, as part of our, our school.